Good morning. This is Melissa with Origins of Peace, your creative peace coach coming to you on our final tip day. So tip number four of finding your voice and becoming a better communicator as an introvert is to confront discomfort. Um, sometimes you are just going to be uncomfortable in situations, um, but you have to confront it. Um, because freedom is on the other side of the things that you fear. So after you do all the other tips, like taking your time to get acclimated with the environment, preparing ahead of time, understanding that your voice has value, then it's time just to jump in there and confront it. So um, whenever you're headed to the conversation or to the event, um, just just know that the feeling of anxiousness that you feel is only temporary. And once you actually confront the thing that scares you, you're going to feel so free. You're going to feel liberated. And you're going to feel like you really accomplished something. So just know that what you have to say matters and that those who are in attendance, those who are in the room, those who are in your presence, they are waiting for you to find your voice and to confront your discomfort. So let's do it. I know I know we've all heard the term, um, do it afraid. So it's time to do that, do it afraid. Because once you do it, you won't be afraid anymore. It'll just become another routine thing. And the more that you do it, you're putting it into practice, 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 practice makes perfect. And if it doesn't make perfect, it at least allows you to show up and be included in the conversation. Okay, so happy Thursday morning to you. I hope these tips have been helpful. Um, again, the resource is how to find your voice and become a better communicator as an introvert. But these tips can be used by anyone, anyone who feels that they need to, um, you know, improve on their communication skills. So I wish you all the success in the world. Until next time, I am Melissa Rivers, your creative peace coach with Origins of Peace. And remember, I am rooting for you. Keep a smile on your face. Don't let anybody turn that smile upside down. You deserve to be heard. You deserve to be in the room. And you deserve to show up and confront your discomfort. So you can find out more about me at originsofpeace.com. And if I can be of service to you, please email me at originsofpeace at gmail.com. Have a fabulous day. Bye-bye.